You are not hateful. You are loving. Contrary to popular opinion about you, you are not lazy, you are hardworking. You are not dull, you are clever. You are not weak, you are strong. You are not self-centered. You are sharing, you care about others. You care about others' feelings. You are not bad, beloved. You are not. And those who really won't really understand you will understand that you are, you are not you are not bad as people might be thinking or feeling. Sometimes the enemy will just put into people's heart, you know, to look at you in a certain way, thinking that you are that bad person, you are self-centered, you are everything negative. You are not. You are not. Before you do anything or take any decision, any decision, you consider people's feelings. You consider people's, uh, um, people's heart. You consider how you, things are going to affect some people while you are trying to make a decision. That's how selfless you are. That's how honest you are. That's how truthful you are. There are some things that you might do that will not please everyone. But if you are, you are, if, if God is signaling you to, to do something or to say something, you just have to do it. Not that because you want to hurt somebody or because you want to like discriminate or do certain things that, you know, are not for people's highest good. You always want the best for people. Glory be to God. You want the best for people. I see the best in you. I see your light. I see your strength. I see the heart you've got for people. I see the love that you've got for people. I see your honesty. I see your humbleness. The Bible says pride comes before the fall. But you aren't prideful, you are humble. You are respectful. You are considerate. You are so understanding. God knows your heart more than anyone else. And God is saying that it doesn't, it doesn't matter how you feel at this moment. It's just a matter of time. The good heart that you've had will, will never fail you. It will always come back to you. People might not see your, your actions being so positive right now. People might not see your, your intentions being so positive right now. People, people might not see your words being so positive right now. But God has a way of showcasing that in the future. God has a way of speaking to you. Or, you know, relaying information about you to those who have been trying to doubt you. Those who have been trying to see you in negative light. You are, you are everything great. You are everything. You are everything wonderful. You are just perfect the way you are. You are perfect the way you are. Not that we are perfect in our characters. No. We are, we are all imperfect beings. And we strive to become perfect. We, we are all striving to become very, very perfect. perfect. So, God has to tell someone this moment that please don't doubt yourself. You are, you are okay. You are fine. You are fine. Let nothing disturb your heart. There comes a time in your life when you like, you, you're asking yourself if you're doing the right thing. God says if your, your mind is at peace about a certain situation, you are doing great. You are doing great. People might not see it to be positive at, at, at a given time. But as time goes on, they're going to be seeing things from your own perspective, from your own point of view. I don't know whom I'm talking to this moment. God said, let not your heart be troubled because it feels like, because sometimes you feel like you are, you are, you are, you are not doing something great or it feels like you are not making the right decision. God said you are on point. You are very much on point. The very fact that you, you consider something to happen a certain way is exactly how 
the, the spirit of God is working in you and, and directing you and, you know, moving you forward. You're guided, right? You are, we are all guided. We are all guided. The fact that you are guided in a certain way doesn't mean that everyone has to go that direction. The fact that I'm guided in a certain way doesn't mean that everyone should come my direction. We all have our own different directions in life. We all have our own different things in life. But at the end of it all, we are here to serve one another in one way or the other. I might not be involved in what you are doing this moment. It doesn't mean that I am hateful or I do not like or I don't want to or whatever or it could be that i'm doing certain things this moment and you don't tend to support me i'll take offense like okay why can't you support me no in one or the other we are connected we are all connected and we are helping each other we are all helping each other so brace yourself don't worry about it. let your heart not be troubled be at peace in your heart you are doing you're doing everything you're doing everything right you are doing everything right your perfection god god knows your imperfection glory to god God knows your imperfection and He is perfecting you. God is perfecting you. God is perfecting you. Our God judges the intents of everybody. He judges the intents of everybody. And He knows what's best for you. He knows what's best for me. I pray peace in your heart. I pray that love that may it continue to be shed abroad in your heart. Glory to God. I pray that may the joy of the Lord be your strength in all situations. I pray that you succeed in all situations. You succeed in all endeavors. You succeed in all ventures. Glory to God. Let your heart be at peace. Go. 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 Do what God has commanded you to do. You are strong. You can do it. There is nothing that you cannot do because you can do all things through Christ who strengthens you. Keep it up. Keep flourishing. God bless you and see you in the next video.